Hey folks, welcome to another numeracy video. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to decrease a number by percentage. Now, I know in the previous video, we had a look at um, percentage discounts, so it's pretty much the same thing. But however, in this particular video, I'm going to focus on how to do these really, really quickly on the calculator. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to actually work out a number that we could multiply 6550 by so that it actually does everything for us. So think about it like this. We've got 100% and we're going to take away 15%. So when we do that, we are actually going to end up with 85% that's actually remaining. So all we're trying to do is we're trying to work out 85% of 6550. Now 85% as a decimal is going to be 0.85 which means to reduce 6550 by 15%, all I'm going to do is 6550 multiplied by 0 0.85. And when I do this, I hope this actually is going to work. No, it's not going to work. All right, so 6550 multiplied by 0 0.85, and that's going to give me improper fraction, change it to a decimal, so it's going to be give me 55.675. And because this is actually money, I would probably put that as $55.68. Let's have a look at question two. Question two, we're going to decrease by 20%. So what I'm going to do is, once again, I'm going to go 100 minus 20% which is going to give me 80%. And if I want to figure out what 80% of a number is, I need to multiply by the decimal, which is 0 0.80. So I've got $90.75 multiplied by 0 0.8. And when I do this, I'm going to get 90.75 multiplied by 0 0.8. And that's going to give me, oh, let's get rid of this answer, $72.60. So as you can see, I mean, these questions were actually going through quite fast, but you just have to get that little um, percentage, co uh, I don't know if you'd call it coefficient, the rate at which something is increasing or decreasing. Um, and again, this comes quite handy at level two when you're looking at like um, things when they're increasing and decreasing, particularly with the exponential questions. But anyway, let's have a look at question three. So we're decreasing by 25%. So we're going to go 100% minus 25%, which is 75%. And then 75% as a decimal is 0 0.75. So then I could, because this is not a dollar, this is just 5060. I could go 5060 multiplied by 0 0.75. So I'm going to go 50.6 multiplied by 0 0.75. And in this case, I have an answer of 37.95. So just keep in mind that when you're actually doing, um, you know, when you're decreasing a number by percentage, all you got to do is figure out the percentage um, of that number. And then you just go number minus whatever that is. And that's what we've done here with the um, calculator, but in a really, really quick way. Now the next part of this video series we're going to be looking at the actual percentage increase and decrease um, but yeah I think doing this part right here the increasing and decreasing with that um, coefficients would really really help you moving forward when you're looking at um, trying to figure out how much percentage something is increased or decreased by. Alright folks that is basically it for this video as always don't forget to like this video share this video and subscribe to keep up with the latest content. Now, there should be a couple of playlists popping up here and here. Great material for revision. And as always, thank you for watching.